Now that's the sensei I know. That hunk of junk was no match for you. <laughs> Serves you right. Keep suffering. Friend against friend, beating the heck out of each other. I don't know why you're making us fight, but it's pointless. We aren't fighting because we hate each other. The reason we can fight is because we respect and trust each other. What are you talking about? Why did you set this tournament up? Pardon my eccentric entrance. What? Hmm. Oh, please excuse me. I didn't have the faintest idea that someone would be here. Faintest? Feigned? Fiend? Something along those lines at any rate. Are you from the Velvet Room? what's known as being hit on? A forbidden ritual where one human approaches another based solely on appearance and bets on the inner self being equally attractive. What? No, I'm not hitting on you. You just remind me of someone I know. Do you happen to know anyone by the name of Margaret? Margaret. Oh, actually, we should introduce ourselves first. I'm Yu Narukami. Ah, oh, that had slipped my mind also. My name is Elizabeth. Dear me, to hear that name fraught with memories in such a mundane, remote place. Margaret is indeed my sister's name. Can I take that to mean that you are another guest of that room? elizabeth son, huh? Well, I guess that's the case. It's true that there was a time when I visited that room. But why is a resident of the Velvet Room here? Did Margaret send you with a message or something? I am currently utterly neglecting my duties. 
Is that so? I have a certain desire. It may take a very long time for it to be realized. In order for my wish to be granted, I require a power much greater than what I have. The power of the wild card that changes bonds into strength. I have a feeling that the key lies there. I know a little about the wild card, but... I feel that the first glue to granting my wish lies within that power. Glue? Flu? Influenza. Something along those lines at any rate. Might I suggest that you and I fight? Oh, how excited this is making me! My expectations are ascending skyward at muck speed! To be direct, I'd like for you to show me the potential slumbering within you. Um... Let me make sure of something, just in case. You understand what I'm saying, right? There's no illusions at work? Such parlor tricks can get stuffed! I see. So you're actually in your right mind here. That's kind of... uh... impressive. I won't be able to hold back. Let us do this. Your fate is in the cards. I see. I am quite content with this outcome. It seems you possess true strength. I believed you were at the limits of your stamina after the battle against Igis earlier. In actuality, your heart almost gave in during your struggle with me. But each time you faltered, the many hearts supporting you gave you strength, helping you to rise again. <sighs> this was truly an intriguing battle. I believe our encounter has borne much flute. Flute? Flu? Chimneys. In any case, I am quite pleased. May I ask you something? 
to continue fighting in order to prevent an undesirable future. It is a path of endless hardship. Would you still choose to walk it? Yeah. Working for a better tomorrow isn't just a one-time thing. The tomorrows keep coming. I would keep fighting for the future we want. Well then, it's time for me to bid you adieu. By your leave, I, Elizabeth, am out of here. <laughs>